Thanks Chris, I'm here with Hannah, the acclaimed football pundit. Hannah, what's been the biggest shock of yesterday's transfer deadline? Well I think the signing of Mycon is an interesting one. He's now 31 and that does not fit the City template, but his close relationship with Mancini could well provide other benefits to the team. Besides, where does this put Mika Richards? I guess we can only wait and see. Everybody's talking about the £4 million deal for Dimitar Berbatov. What do you make of it? Well, it's a steal of the century. He can score goals and that's all Fulham will be expecting of him. And as we know, he can do that. And how will Spurs deal with the loss of their two most creative players from last season? Um, they will we'll need to find a way to keep the play creative. In fact, I'm surprised they didn't bid for the young Uruguayan midfielder Gaston Ramirez. He lacks consistency, sure, but there's absolutely no doubt in his potential. But I think AVB and Levy were quite determined to sign Moutinho, and unfortunately for them the talks collapsed. But that's football. Hmm. Finally, Hannah, what are your views for the rest of the season in the Premier League, and who's your team to watch? Hmm. I think we are going to see more teams competing for those top European spots, but I'm pretty certain the title will go to one of the Manchester teams. My team to watch this season has to be Newcastle, who have a very confident squad with a very competent manager who likes to play high pressing 4-4-2, which a lot of teams are going to find hard to deal with. Thank you, Hannah. Over to you, Chris.